right guys so I I just got off work we're getting ready to uh, pound out some some uh, chest and some triceps and some, some shoulders and I thought well since it's bench press day I thought I'd take a moment and make a quick video and show you guys a product that's totally gotten me back in the game on my bench press and just not on my bench press but my incline bench, my decline bench, my flies, that's another thing that's really um, corrected for me. So um, a little history here. Uh, for, I don't know, past year and a half, maybe a little longer, you know, I, I knew I had irritation in the shoulder and I did a really good job of just totally rehabbing it, you know, and um, uh, I was doing really good and I was bench pressing in the 300 pound range. But just through the activities of life, just one day I, I tweaked it. I tweaked it really bad. It wasn't lifting, I just, I just tweaked it, you know. <clears throat> and so uh, I came back, I got up pretty close to the 300 pound range and that was it. All of a sudden my shoulder was screaming, I racked it uh, and I was done. And immediately right there I stripped my waist down just to just the bar just to do a, a full range of motion and no way. Once I uh, lifted the bar off the J hooks, I was screaming, I knew right then, drop the bar, you know. So um, my brother-in-laws and I, we went fishing after that on the boat. My shoulder hurt so bad, it was all I could do to reel. It, it was screaming. It, it wasn't fun. It wasn't fun at all. So I came back and I thought, okay. I'm going to, you know, I thought about it on my fishing trip. What am I going to do? I thought, well, what I'll do is, you know, uh, dumbbell flies for strength and size, every bit, if not better, than bench press. I thought I would do, you know, just do only those, came back. I couldn't even do five pounds because I was unstable. I just couldn't lock it in, nothing. And so I really began researching my shoulder issue. And upon researching it in the search engine came this product. Uh, this is it's called the Original Slingshot. I'll put a uh, link in the description box below. In a moment I'm going to show you exactly what this has done for me. I will actually show you how well I'm lifting with this. Um, so, you know, I saw it and the first thing, first thing I thought was, you know, there's so many scams out there. but this point I'm like all right you know I've, I'm, I'm gonna do anything I can to, to correct this and that's the place to start it's pretty affordable what have I got to lose so I ordered it all right I received it and this is what happened the first time I put it on I did a full workout up to 135 pounds, a 45 plate on each side, zero pain, full range of motion, full control coming down to the bottom. I was uh, super stable. I could tell maybe my right was lagging just a little on the straight side, but it was smooth and I had zero pain. So um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you uh, what I'm benching now with this. Uh, with this. I normally start with the bar just for right now, baby steps. The bar, 10 pounds, 25 pounds, 35 up to uh, 45 on each side. So what I'm going to do first off, I'm going to do one set. I uh, just got off work, so I'm just going to just gonna run the bar, full range of motion. And I'll just show you what my range of motion like, is like. Now, before I had this, I could not even get this uh, bar out of the J-hooks. So here we go. happening with it is when I started working with it I had to pull it in closer 
I had to get the chicken wings in. That that really helped. And that's that's what this does. This forces you to pull your elbows in. So to do that, I matched it with my grip just a little bit. But now what's happened, and when I bench with this, you're going to see that now my elbows are starting to go out and uh, it's restoring the stability. Now, the thing is, is with this, I thought, well, if I'm wearing that, am I really benching? Oh yeah, you're benching. I feel it. And I'm getting the pump, I'm getting the full pump, I'm getting the full range of motion. So this is how it works. It has these, uh, you can just put your fingers in there if it's too tight to get it on, all right? Just kind of pull it up there like that. Um, get it around your big old pythons there. My little weenie arms, you know, they fit really easy in this, okay? Um, so, so there we go. It's, it's, it's just like that. It's like I say, when I started, you know, you're in close, so I mashed it with my grip. Now what's happening is I'm coming out and my strength is improving uh, uh, immensely, okay? So what I'm going to do, this is what I planned today. I thought about it all day. Um, I warmed up at the bar. I'm just going to um, visit this like the old days, you know. Um, first set, you know, put the 45-pound uh, plate on. There we go, okay. So there's my starting point. And uh, all right, so here we go. Uh, normally, I would have went a 10 on each side, a quarter on each side, a 35 on each side, and then I would have went to here. But I felt so good last time that here we go. First time, here we go, maiden voyage. There you go, guys. So let me tell you what I'm feeling. Um, when I got this, I thought, well, will I really be doing the workout? Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm feeling it. So what this has done now is now, one, I'm back on my game for my full range of motion. Two, I'm getting the total pump and the rip. Three, now, in everyday life, going to work, going out to play, you know, putting lumber in the back of the truck, whatever, I have my stability back. That's huge. So this thing, if this is the game plan right here for me, okay? So what I want to do, my um, let's try, let's try 185. much smoke and my asthma is killing me but you don't stop <sighs> so I had originally pulled it in like about here but now like 
you know, I know my ring finger now. Which is good, it just works your triceps more. to get my strength back. Um, this is awesome. I highly recommend this. I don't know anybody from this company. What a great product. I just thank them for it. And if you're having any kind of shoulder issues or you think you might, man, this is the way to go. Okay. Uh, cheapest rehab you're going to find. Right. So now, um, on that last set, I could have got two or four, two or four more reps, okay? But right now, what I'm on, if your shoulder's hurting you, you don't want to go high reps. Um, that's going to irritate it. You know, the high reps, I like that because that's the athletic side. That's the, um, uh, that's, you know, it's the athletic side. But for right now, what I'm doing is I'm doing my uh, five sets of five reps. And I'm getting the strength and the stability, right? So really, um, I'm pretty much capable of warming up with more than 135, okay? Um, I think I'll hold it there, but basically what I'm on is, you know, five sets of five. So how it works is at the, uh, once I kind of, you know, now that I'm getting everything back, I got to figure out what my top baseline is, all right, and my, of course, my bottom baseline. Once I figure that out, every time I cycle around to my bench press day, I'll just sneak 10 pounds on and do five sets of five, and what that's going to do is get my strength back. That's what I need. Strength and stability. No irritation. That's the smartest way to go. So, so like I say, you know, five sets of five, and then the next time I cycle around, I'll just sneak 10 pounds on there. 10 pounds? If I'm resting right, I'm eating right, I can definitely push another 10 pounds. Now, where I will kind of put the screws to it or the pedals or the metal to it is um, definitely on my dumbbell flies. My dumbbell flies, I don't need this now, um, which I really uh, couldn't really. I, I tried it the first couple times and that really helped, but you really can't go the full range of motion. But it got me, it got me kind of moving the weights. That's how bad it was. Uh, after uh, two cycles of that without this, literally, literally, I was starting with five pound weights, but I was going full range of motion, and now my weight's coming up on that, so for my, um, my flies, I'm capable of going that eight to 12 reps and just really pacing myself and just, you know, really watching for any kind of pain. But the pain comes from that bench. That bench is what really nails you, okay? So low, low reps and uh, get your, your weight up there, all right? Um, that's what's helping me the most. So right here, this is the uh, Slingshot, the original Slingshot, fabulous product. If you get it, do not store this where it's hot, where it's warm, store it in the house, otherwise, in about oh a summer's length time this will be like hardened spaghetti uh guys and gals that's the end of this video god bless we'll see you on the next